What's up, dorks and guardians? <laughs> What's up, dorks? And up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you all for stopping by. Appreciate you. Before we get into the video, put a like on this as it helps out the channel greatly. And you already know, subscribe or not subscribe or don't. We're currently at 445 subscribers. Again, we are running a giveaway on the channel. So, if we hit 500 subs, I'm giving away two copies. Two copies of the final shape. One of which will be all seasons included. The other, guess what? I've changed my mind. All seasons included. So it will be the more expensive one to give out uh, all seasons. Well, episodes. But you guys are new here thank you for stopping by anyways let's get into it let's see what daddy here has let's see dada let's see what you got I bring gifts of the nine. Gifts you sorely. those of you who do not have the exotic again it's in the shop so let's go over what he has here for us today war with coil catalyst we got the bad juju catalyst very good gun right now with uh it's actually slept on with uh, anti-barrier, but it is very good weapon. If you guys have not gotten it, I recommend it. Very shit stats on the worm crust or the worm husk crown, the worm crust. <laughs> That's what it should be because it's crusty and dusty and old. Uh, let's see here. Shoulder uh, safe for shoulder charge abilities. You get an overshield of sprinting at full health with a seismic strike, hammer strike, or a shield bash. Equipped and charged. Yeah, these are I mean, these aren't where you want them stat-wise, but they're not a bad exotic. Then we have the Storm Dancer's Brace. M very mid exotic. Uh, I'm not really a Warlock main. If you guys don't have any of these, I highly encourage you to pick them up to get into the loot pool. And, of course, we have our class item exotics. And then I'm going to pick this up for another exotic cipher. Let's go see what else he's got. Here's what he's offering here. After you spend like 40 strange coins, I think, it unlocks it. And then we got exotic ingram, Hawk Tua, with shit-ass moving target and smooth grip. I'm not a fan of this hand can. I know people love this for PvP. I'm not a fan of it. Sweet business. It's a pretty decent exotic... I wouldn't say it's S tier. I'd say it's probably like a, a C or a D right now. This is an auto rifle, so it technically was in with the meta, but a primary auto rifle exotic is kind of cringe when you have other better ones that are legendary. Sunshot, definitely S tier. Would highly recommend picking this up if you don't have it. And then Two Tailed Fox, which I could have swore he sold last week as well. I could be wrong, but. Once you get no, he had the catalyst last week. Once you get the catalyst fully done, it turns this gun from it gives a uh, void and solar, and then the last one is arc that jolts them. So highly recommend picking this up as it's very good. We got the death adder, mulligan dragonfly, not a bad roll. Better SMGs though. Subsistence and slideways on the fraction fire. Uh, the decider. Lead from gold, very good perk. Wellspring, not so much. Zen moment, dragonfly. On the submachine gun. Again, this is also another, the only submachine gun in the game that has the phase mag on it. So if you guys want something just to mess around with, I highly recommend picking that up just to play with. The Hasku. Huskow. Crap. Blast Brute. Very shit. Wellspring's not good. And then we have the Quick Fang. I'd like to know where the hell... Oh, they're right here. Also, not a drill, guys. If you guys need to get your hands on an adept weapon for Nightfall, he is selling two Nightfall ciphers for 97 strange coins. That is a lot of strange coins. Uh, right now, you can go play PvP and get more strange coins as it is double rewards and a rep. Could have swore this week was Iron Banner as well. I swore it was. Yeah, it is Iron Banner. 
While I'm here, I don't think I went over Iron Banner in the weekly reset. So let's go look and see if he's got anything new. I doubt it. I actually have to take a look and see if I need uh, anything here from Iron Banner. So, might as well look at it while we're in the video, right? Right. Alright, so. Yeah, I need the shader. I want to get the shader for the season ends. And this would be the last... I don't know how long this is going to run for. Two weeks? If it is, that's not bad. No new guns. I mean, these came out earlier in the season. Re remastered, basically. The only, like, new ones, I'd say, is this one and this one. And this one, which I believe, was there last season, but I could be wrong. This gun's mid. Not that good. This gun, decent. This one, though, for you PvE players, this is the one you want to get. It's very strong. It's a waveframe um, strand, so highly recommend getting it. But that is, will be it for the video, guys. Those of you who are also are like, well, what's the adept weapon? The only way to get the adept weapon is by completing the Grandmaster Nightfall. Fairly easy. I have a guide up on the channel. Stupid easy to do. And the gun that you would get this week is the Wild Style. I actually might go farm that because that is a very fun gun. But anyways, guys, like, subscribe, see you all in the next video. Again, like, subscribe, don't, it's your choice. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.